let's talk about live demos and events and things for your product. So last week we had a BA5 with our Chamber of Commerce, so that's a business after five. Yeah, so it's where local people in the community come and see a business and we tell them about what we do and yeah. what we're up to. And this time we chose to obviously tell them about our business and our product, so we did a live demonstration um, for that. And it can be really daunting. Yeah. You know, it's quite a scary experience networking for some of us, especially our, our, our technical sort of people, mm. like myself. Yeah, so um, I think that it, we practiced what we were going to say, obviously, because we were hosting the event um, in our speeches, which was really helpful. Yeah. Um, so yeah. I think practice is definitely key. Also, too, we have um, someone at, if you can find someone at your event that you do know, and you can sort of say, look, I'm not feeling too confident because a lot of the time it's a room full of people that you don't know so if you can find someone that you do know that you can say look I'm just not feeling it they can introduce you to people and sort of get you started because yeah, really way. everyone's in the same boat totally. everyone kind of feels a little bit uncomfortable at these things yeah that's totally right another really good thing is that it's really important to listen I always find that I remember people who listen to me if I'm if I'm talking about something and telling them about my product, I can see that they're listening and that they're showing interest, and therefore I will remember them and their product or whatever they're doing. So true. Yeah, mm. you build on their vibe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So and you sort of build that relationship. Whereas I've had some people at some events that just want to give me their card and yep, that's thrust it. it down their throat and run away. Yeah, and, and that's not that's not, that's not how you want to be remembered. Well, no. you just won't be remembered. You'd be like, oh, I've got this card, but we'll remember for the it's, yeah, yeah. Well, that's right, and you don't want that. No. So. So listening is really important. Mm -hmm, that's yep. right. Yeah, another thing I always forget is my business cards. Yeah, it's important to have them on hand. It really is. Definitely. I mean, it's there's no point in someone telling you that they're interested in something and can I have your card and you don't have one. It looks no. a little bit unpro. So if you have business cards, take them. If you don't, somehow... Give me a Snapchat or something. Yeah, give them something. <laughs> yeah. Um, I guess trying not to be too salesy. Mm. Um, it's all about building relationships and meeting the people that are... Um, or meeting other people in business and how you can help each other without really trying to sell. Yeah, like the thing that you went to the other day, it's kind of understanding the issues that they're having with their business yeah, yeah. can actually bring you business. Yeah, that's it, and helping each other. Helping each other, yeah, yeah it's all about helping. Mm. I think follow-up is really important. You can get a stack of business cards um, for people that you know, may be interested in your product or um, may have just wanted to give you their business card, but perhaps even if you get a pile of business cards, maybe just fold the corner of the ones that are interested in mm. you sending them more information about what you have to offer. Yeah, or if they might be having a problem with something that might be totally unrelated, right. you can like send them an email and just reach out to yeah. them and say, I can help. Well, it's all, it all, it definitely helps with building those relationships, you know, yeah. after we had our BA5 last week, I had a couple of people who were wanted the demo video um, sent to them so they could then pass it on. So remembering yeah. that and actually following up and sending the video was really helpful because they come back and you know, you've know you started to build that relationship. Yeah, it's all about relationships. Yeah. Cool. Cool. So there are just some tips on networking. Do we need to so what? This? Yeah, what would be the, the key things to remember? Um, I think the key things to remember are to listen, Try not to be too salesy. Yeah, remember that you're all there for the same reason. Yeah. Not all everyone humans. is comfortable. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Cool, thanks guys, and um, talk to you next week. Bye.